Today we play Super Sonic Odyssey, where you are Sonic, you are very, very fast, and you try to save Princess Peach from the evil Dr. Eggman. It is so much fun to play through the game with an uncontrollably fast speed, powerful jumps, and cool boss fights. Thank you so much for watching, and I really hope you enjoy this video. In the skies above Peach's castle, we have Dr. Eggman attacking Sonic. Sonic looks so cool with the Mario hat. So this is actually an updated version of Super Super Sonic Odyssey because we have played this mod recently but all kinds of changes have been made to this. Sonic's graphics look so much better now and there were a bunch of changes actually made to the gameplay that you guys are going to see once we start running around and I think that this Sonic just actually looks fantastic. This is a brand new Sonic model that we are using here. Dr. Eggman looks as hilarious as ever throwing that cap over there and our Mario cap goes flying. Now we just have Sonic. Now Sonic doesn't have the Mario cap anymore and look at this. What happened? Sonic turns around and he gets hit with Bowser's cap, but it isn't actually Bowser, it's actually Dr. Eggman. And wait a minute, why is Princess Peach being saved by Sonic? What is going on over here? And here comes Mario's hat floating down. We should have changed that to an S. Maybe I should change that to an S and make it blue. But there we go, Dr. Eggman stomps on the hat. Time for my wedding with Peach! Jealous Mario! Why is Dr. Eggman getting married to Princess Peach? <laughs> Something that you guys are going to see very, very quickly is that Sonic is even faster than before! We can run much more quickly than Cappy and all the other ghosts. Wait, Cappy's back there somewhere, right? Where is Cappy even? Oh, Cappy's over here all of a sudden. I'm pretty sure we outran Cappy, but Cappy is now over here apparently. And Sonic looks so good in this cutscene. You've landed in the Cap Kingdom. We've been under attack by the same Bowser monster that gave you such a trouncing. Actually, it was Eggman who was attacking us, not Bowser. <laughs> and I laugh every time that I see this because it's so funny because I'm always expecting Bowser, but it's Dr. Eggman here. I wanted to chase that Bowser monster in a ship of my own, but look, all the ships were destroyed in the attack. Sonic looks around, he just has a smirk on his face even when he shakes his head he just has that smirk on his face we just have to reach that tower then we can go to the next kingdom you know we should team up let's do it sonic nods but wait i don't have my cap sonic you don't even normally wear a cap and cappy's on the head but wait a minute that actually looks pretty good i think that actually suits him well what do you guys think and now it's time for cappy to transform and look what cappy's gonna transform into the mario cap but when Sonic is actually wearing the Mario cap, there's nothing on his head, which is pretty cool. Okay, and we are nice and fast. It is actually almost uncontrollable how fast you are. Wait, can I? Whoa. Oh, yeah. Oh, I wanted to see if I could jump across there. Yeah, we are really quite fast. We can just go up and down this hill like it is nothing. Run through here and let's get through here. And you know what? Something that I'm wondering and something that some of you might be wondering also is... Okay, hold on. First, let's just get this checkpoint flag if I could get the checkpoint flag in case we need it okay now the question is oh my goodness we're faster than those coins spawning but the question is is the game going to be easier or more difficult are we going to be able to complete the game more quickly or is it going to take us more time to complete the game okay that's nice that we got that over there let's just see come here come here come here okay now jump on him there we go okay we defeated that boss pretty quickly because you know what since you are faster you'd think that maybe you can complete the game more quickly but since it's difficult to control, that might make some parts of the game actually more difficult. So here's an absolutely iconic cutscene at the start of the game, Super Mario Odyssey. Mario's inside this amp over here. He's making his way over to the Cascade Kingdom. Now let's see Sonic pop out. Hopefully we made the changes in this mod correctly and Sonic flies out. And there we are! It is Sonic with the Mario cap. I think Sonic looks so good with the Mario cap like that. And I think that's also a fantastic moment for the thumbnail. That'll most likely be the thumbnail of this video. All right, let's go. So we should be able to run through this kingdom quite quickly. Let's capture that guy. Oh, he's not even running towards me because I'm already way over here. I am just way too fast for these guys. Let's just come here, get the power moon. I almost got the power moon before this cutscene paused us over here. Oh, jumping past the power moon, but there we go. We've got our first power moon. What a lovely power moon to collect. And Sonic looks absolutely fantastic. Okay, time for this piece of the bridge to come down. Let's make our way through the kingdom. Oh, wait, wait, but first you have to see this cutscene where we walk up to the Odyssey. Man, what a game. It's such a cool idea to have an airship that's in the shape of a cap like that. Okay, but we are, of course, going to want to get up here and wait is there a moon there or is the moon there only later okay i guess the moon is only there after you defeat the boss so where we want to go whoa i forgot how quick we were oh my goodness it's actually kind of unbelievable how fast we are okay but we want to catch this dinosaur of course and then we can use this dinosaur to get up there because it is a nice way to skip to the boss okay so let's come down here let's get ready let's get ready hopefully we can do this on the first try that'd be nice let's see let's go and boost me up and 
Pop out and bring me there. All right, we made it very nice. That's such a cool way to make it to this boss. Okay, but look how fast I am. If the chain shop is going to be coming towards me, then I could just move out of the way. Okay, hold on, let's shake the controller. Now pop out. There we go, very nice hit. Now look, I can run circles around this boss. She's gonna have no idea where to even throw that chain chump. Cause look at how I'm running. Look, I'm way over here. You can't get me, I'm way over here. Go, see that? Okay, now throw Pappy again. Go, 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 catch it, catch it. Okay, very nice. Now come on over here. Okay, pop out. Come on, pop out, pop out, pop out. Go, there we are, very nice. Now I'm just gonna run way over here. You can't throw it this far, can you? You can't, can you? Cause look, I'm way over here. And? No, you can't reach that far. That's too bad for you. So sad for you. So sad. Okay, but you just catch it like this and nice and easy boss fight. That is so cool. We're so fast we can very easily keep a distance from the boss. That made it super easy. That might be more quickly than how I normally do it. And the boss explodes and we get a lovely power moon that we can collect for that. So let's just get that right there. And we will soon have enough power moons to make it to the next kingdom. I think we need one or two more power moons still. Okay, so it looks like we need just one more power moon and a nice one that we can get quickly is we can just run over here, capture this guy. I guess we could have gotten this one before that we can go like this. Jump over, grab that power moon right there. That is perfect. Now we should be able to just make our way back and we probably also could have done this earlier. Now let's just run back. It is so nice how quickly you can move if you forget something like that. And now, Sonic is at the Odyssey, and he has enough power moons to power up the Odyssey, to partially restore the Odyssey like this, so that we have enough energy to make it to the next kingdom. But it's kind of funny that you need a certain number of power moons from each kingdom to make it to the next kingdom, and the power isn't based on the total number of power moons. You'd think that if you got a bunch of power moons in one kingdom, then you would have enough power moons, you'd have enough energy to bring you to the next kingdom. But it makes sense that the power moons that you have to collect, that there's a certain number that you have to collect based on the kingdom that you're at. Otherwise, you could just skip through kingdoms. But it's funny, in some earlier games, you can do that, such as in Super Mario 64. If you get a bunch of power moons, or sorry, not power moons, power stars, in the earlier levels, then you could actually skip some of the later levels in Super Mario 64. And something really funny that I've heard about Super Mario 64 is that in... One of the levels, Snowman's Land, it's a level where you actually have to jump into a wall to access the level, but when you look at the mirror, you can see that in the mirror there's a painting, but where you are on your side of the mirror there's no painting. So that's the hint that you have to jump into the wall. Some people have gotten to the credits of Super Mario 64 after beating the game, and they thought, wait a minute, this snow level doesn't look familiar. So that's pretty funny. Oh, and uh, Sonic has a little bit of Mario's hair right now, because uh, Sonic's actually using the Captain Mario hat right now. I'm gonna have to change that back to Sonic's regular hat in a moment. Because uh, Sonic looks pretty funny with that Mario hair. Alright, let's go collect some power moons in the Sand Kingdom. And you know what? Since we are so fast, this might actually make some things uh, quite easy. Because we want to make it over to this... Oh no, oh no, oh no, that's not where we want to be. We want to get that bird. Come here. Can I get the bird? Can I get the bird? Where's the bird? Bird. Get the bird! Yeah, okay, we actually got it. Okay, that's amazing. I'm so glad that worked out. I was worried that we would actually miss that bird and then we'd have to go chase it, even though we are this fast. That actually worked out very nicely. Okay, and now we can just get this power moon here. That's another nice one to get. There's a nice second power moon. We can drop down in here. Oh, some of these power moons. Oh boy, I'm thinking about what ones are going to be easier, what ones are going to be different. And what ones are we going to be able to get in a different way? Wait, is the power moon here or is it on the bottom right? I remember it was either here or on the bottom right. Okay, this one is here. Okay, in that other room, there's one near the bottom right. A rumble from the sandy floor. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, so now let's just run on over this way. Oh, I didn't even see that those were enemies there. I was running so quickly. You know what? This makes me want to replay Sonic Frontiers. I never did finish Sonic Frontiers, actually. I have played... Whoa, what in the world? What is going on? What's going on? Where's the rest of Sonic's body? Wait, is it because we're sandy a little bit? Is it because we got some sand on our body? Is that why? Okay, yeah, sure. Okay, great. So when we do a ground pound, now all of a sudden we're visible again. That's so funny that that actually made our body invisible. Oh, wow. This is so strange. This is so strange. Okay, so Sonic becomes invisible a little bit when that uh, sand gets on him. But that's all right. Let's take this. We can bring this guy to over here. Explode that one, that's very nice. Now we can get this power moon. Inside a block is a hard place. We can probably just jump over to that one and almost run off. I'm not sure if we can make it to that next island 
up there without a bullet build though, because normally you need a bullet build to jump that far. I don't know if we can jump that far. Let's grab this guy. Grab it. Yes! Yes, we got it. Okay, that's amazing. I wasn't sure if we'd be able to make it or not, but let's see. Now pop out. Go like this. Jump up and get me up there. All right. Whoa! Don't run off. Don't run off. Don't run off. It is way too easy to accidentally run off. Okay, let's grab this. This is very nice. Wait, is that a frozen bird over there? Is that a bird frozen in a block of ice? How did I never see that before? Okay, I thought this coin sound was my phone ringing. Now hold on, is there a power moon that we get with that guy? I can't remember if there's a power moon we get with that guy, but wait. I wanna get that power moon up there. Can I get that with a bullet bill? That'd be nice if we could get that with a bullet bill. Let's see, how high can we get up? Oh, come on, come on, come on. We can definitely make it up there because we have a very high jump and a very high wall jump. Let's go like this and let me up and bring me up there. We barely made that. Whoa! I just ran laps around that bullet bill there. Okay. Hey! Ay, 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 ay! We fell. Let's go here. Don't crash into anything. Okay, now go. Go, 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 go. Can I reach that or no? There's no way that we can get up there. How in the world are you supposed to get up there? Are you supposed to bonk into that with the jacks? See, I don't remember what you're supposed to do for that. Okay, but you know what? There's a sphinx right here, so let's have a chat with this sphinx. Oh there, Mr. Sphinx, I'd like to answer your question. What does the Bowser want? It wants a ring. It wants a ring. That's what it wants from here. Yeah, that isn't really real. It's so funny how the Sphinx moves like that. Okay, and you know what? Even just getting into a door like that, it's a bit difficult to aim. So let's get some of these. Some of these. Get some money. And I'm also trying to collect the Power Moon. I'm trying to get the money and the Power Moon. But bit difficult to get either because you're s it's a bit difficult to control yourself when you're so fast. Okay, so let's see where we are going to go. Are we going to go run up maybe? Oh, and you know where else we can go? Hold on, there's a spot right down here. Oh, and we're a bit sandy, so let's just come down here. Slide down, slide down, and come on up now, Sonic, and get that power moon right there. Perfect. Okay, that's a lovely power moon. Hidden room in the flowing sands. We only need a few more power moons before we're done with this area. And we could probably even... Oh, I was hoping that we could jump up like this with a wall jump. So funny to see Sonic being a bit invisible like this. Gotta get up here, gotta get up here, gotta get up here. What's a nice way up here? Okay, we can go like this. And... There we go. Okay, and there should be two nice power moons that we could get here. We should be able to... Break that. And... We could grab... Oh no, that bullet bill just exploded. So, you know what? I'll just come here, here first. Go. Oh, Sonic! Okay, good. We got that one. Now, the bullet bill should be coming here. But wait, do I even need the bullet bill to get up there? We probably don't, to be honest. Let's just go like this. Let me up here. Perfect. And now from here, can I just jump to there? Go! Hooray! Oh, don't celebrate yet, because we didn't get the power moon. There we go. Now we got the power moon. It's so funny to be getting this power moon by just making jumps and dives like that and without using Cappy, because I'm so used to using happy over there, as I'm sure many people are, because that is normally the way that you move. And I'm not making a cow impression right now. I just happen to say move like that, because that's how I was moving. Let me up. And let me hear, maybe. And you know what? I'd like to come up here as well. Hooray. Okay, let's get in here. Now, something cool is going to happen when we go into this pipe. Some of you might know what's going to happen. Look what we've got. Oh, no. Oh, no. I have to fix this so that it is a uh, 2D Sonic, because right now it's 2D Mario. Okay, before we go into a pipe the next time, I am going to make sure that we are... Gonna make sure that we are 2D... Bounce up! Oh, we can't make it up there, I think. Gonna make sure that we are 2D Sonic instead of 2D Mario. Oh, no. Oh, and we're actually uh, quite a bit faster than normal. Let's go. Okay. Now go here. Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna go down here and get that one. Okay, that's nice that we were able to get that. Now we want to make it up high, of course. So let's get ready. Let's get ready. Go! Wow, that was so weird how I just bounced on that guy. Okay, but get, you know, maybe get the checkpoint flag so that if we fall off without getting the power moon, then we can just teleport back up here and get the power moon. That might be a nice way to get it. But let's see, wait a minute. Can I just collect this guy? Oh, no! I was hoping that that was a new eagle that I could collect. Okay, let's see. Where else can we get some power moons? We can get two power moons over there. Oh, wait, I think there's one power moon around here. Is this the one? Hold on. Okay, that's not close enough. But we can go right there. Okay, there's a nice power moon for invisible Sonic to collect. Sonic just with his face and his hands going undercover in the desert right now. But hold on, there's another power moon I remember around here. Oh, I know where we can get some more power moons. These power moons will be so easy to get, actually. Hold on, there's a cactus somewhere around here. We can just grab this cactus, make it move out of the way. Then we ground pound at the spot where the cactus was. Then we can get this power moon. And then, it looks like we only need one more power moon, but there are one or two easy power moons that we could get over here. Maybe even three. Yeah, actually, we could just ground pound right here. 
And there we go, we can get this power moon, and that's super easy, now we have enough power moons. For the birds gather, we could have also gotten the music note up there, and I don't know if we could have also gone fishing with the Lakitu or not yet, it's so funny that right now it just looks like hands. Sonic is just invisible, we are too fast. And now, Sonic is back all of a sudden, let's go to the next kingdom. That was a relatively quick kingdom, that was not too bad. Now we have a fork in the road, we can go to the lake kingdom or the wooded kingdom, so we will of course first go to the lake kingdom, I think the lake kingdom is a nice fast one. And I believe I went there when I first played this game. I have my first playthrough of this game up on YouTube. Here we are, the Lake Kingdom! And this is a pretty fun kingdom to also do speedruns of because... Well, you can get the Power Moons in this kingdom quite quickly. And it might be... I'm not sure if it'll be easier or more difficult for us with our different movement. It'll be different. So some things might feel a bit strange. But... We should still be okay with... Okay, I didn't mean to fall down here. Can I get back up, please? Okay, it's nice that we can get back here. I was thinking of getting this checkpoint flag, maybe, just in case. Because we do want to go here. I don't know if we need this, but we'll come here just in case, just so that we could go like this. This is a bit slow. This the fastest thing in the world to do. Let's just come across like this, and we'll go and get that power move there. And maybe we'll also be able to get the one up high. I'm not sure if our jump will be good enough to do that. Let's see if we can do this. Like this. And, no, we can't jump high enough to reach that, unfortunately. Or fortunately, depending how you look at it. Okay, so we're gonna come down here. We are going to get this power moon that's in here. Look out, cheap cheap! Don't touch me, cheap cheap! Okay, there we go, we got that power moon, very nice. Cheap cheap crossing. Hey, how many more power moons do we need? Just a few more. Let's see, oh, oh, there's one right here for us, right on the back of Dory. I'll take that. Lake seems noisy! Yeah, it sure does, doesn't it? Okay, so let's see, we can get one more power moon. And then after that, we can uh, just face the boss, and then we'll have a multi-moon, and that'll be enough power moons. So let's just come over here and ground pound this. I'm not sure if this is faster than bringing a cheap cheap up to the person who wants to see a cheap cheap. It probably isn't. It's probably faster to grab a cheap cheap and bring the cheap cheap up, or even to get one of the power moons that are up there. But I saw this power moon handy over here, so I thought, hey, let's just come get this one over here. Whoa, good find. Thank you, Cappy. Okay, from the broken pillar case, now let's swim up. Oh, and doesn't Sonic drown in some Sonic games? If you stay in water for too long, makes sense that that would happen in a video game. Okay, so let's see, we want to make our way over there. Let's go like this, and can we jump nicely from here? Let's see, let's go like this, this, let me up here now. Okay, very nice, that's not the way that I was expecting to get up there, because that's not normally how you move in this part of the game. Okay, wait, let's just do a jump like that, and bring me up! Nice! We just barely made that, but we made it. Okay, now it's time for another boss fight. Okay, now, how are we gonna do this boss fight? Oh, boy! Wait, 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 am I allowed to just jump on his head? Oh, boy! Oh, boy, I don't know if I can just jump on his head, or if I should do this. Go! 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 Okay, I think maybe now I can just jump on his head like this, right? Yeah, there we go, that works! Okay, okay, now let's just be careful. Let's see, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. That's not when you want to jump on his head. Wait. Hey! Hey! He damaged me again! Okay, so the speedrun strategy is clearly not working here. Oh, maybe I can uh, get over to his head like this, though. Let's see. Get me on his head! Where's your- Oh, no! We lost our boosted health! That is so sad! That is really so, so sad! Okay, let's just jump onto his head like this. Hey! Where's your head? Where's your head, you little Bugs Bunny rabbit? Come! Come! I'm stopping you there, and I'm bouncing on your head like this. Where is your head?! Where is your head, bro? Give me your head, you little rabbit. I'm gonna kick you up and put you in a stew! I will put you in my stew, you little rabbit! I think I've actually heard Squeaks say that before. Squeaks is this hilarious streamer. He does a lot of Super Mario 64 speedrunning. I didn't even think that, but yeah, I think that he says the same thing about Mips. But yeah, you know, what's the thing with Mario players and having problems with rabbits? You know what? I'm just gonna do this the intended way. Well, not 100% intended, but it's kind of intended. Not necessarily the speedrun strategy where you just do a ground pound and then you bounce on the guy and you take him out very quickly. Okay, so that is definitely longer than the way that you could do it normally if you know how to speedrun it. Okay, so we do have enough power moons for the next kingdom, so it is now time to go to the Lake King- or sorry, not the Lake Kingdom, we're at the Lake Kingdom. We're now going to the Lake Kingdom again! We're just gonna keep doing the Lake Kingdom until we beat the game. Now, we are going to the Forest Kingdom next. What if... I made a mod where every kingdom was replaced with the Lake Kingdom, and to beat the game, all you had to do is just do the Lake Kingdom over and over again. I guess it'd be very good practice for speedrunning the Lake Kingdom. 
Okay, but next up is, of course, the Forest Kingdom. So let's go herb the Wooded Kingdom. Next up is the Wooded Kingdom. And for some reason, this does actually remind me of Sonic because this does seem like the kind of level that you'd see in a Sonic game. And okay, now we should be able to catch this rabbit quite quickly, right? Where's the rabbit? Where's the rabbit? Where's the rabbit? Come here, rabbit. We're so much faster than the rabbit. We can definitely catch the rabbit like that now, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay, give me that power moon, please. Thank you very much. And hold on. There's a rock around here that we need to grab. Is this the one that we need to break? I think this is the one that we need to break. Let's just run straight into that one, and it just explodes into dust, and now we can collect this power moon. And hold on. Are these guys going to sell me a power moon right now if I want it? Will you sell me a power moon, please? Yes, perfect. I can just buy a power moon from you right here for 100 coins. That is absolutely perfect. Exactly what I need. All right. Now. Now, let's just head up this waterfall. I think doing a jump here would be nice. We could go like this and like that. All it takes is just a single jump. That is how powerful we are. Well, a single jump and a wall jump, I should say. Now, hang on. What would be a nice way to get up here? I guess we could go like this and hey my dive didn't work okay okay that was strange let's try again oh my goodness and i accidentally walked into that guy there let's try this again let's go oh we can just go straight up like that okay now break that and give me that power mode okay that was way too much struggle for that that should not have been as difficult as it was okay let's come on down now let's run along throw that there and looks like we're running through here we are so fast that it is difficult to control i actually don't want to run off immediately because Yes, this is the guy that we need. We need to catch this guy right here. Hold on, this isn't the way that we want to go. We actually want to head up this way, because if we could stretch up to here and get up to here, then there'll be a power moon that we can get right back here. We just have to break this right here, and there's our power moon. Very nice, a lovely power moon. Climb the cliff to get the nut. And we can jump down into this water here. The ground pound there, and now we can just swim into this pipe here. Let's just be careful to not die. Hopefully, we can control ourselves in this situation. Oh boy, I wanted to be fast enough to make it through. It did not work as intended. But now, Huang, how can we get up there? Can we go like this? Let me up here and give me the power moon. Okay, that's nice that we got that. Now, let's just go and get the other power moon here, which should be at the end here. I bumped into that guy. Let me up here. Move, 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 let me, right there, there we go, okay, so we got that one, so we took two damage, but that's fine, because both times we just got healed shortly after when we got the power moon, okay, let's see where we are going next, let's come up this way, let's grab this checkpoint flag, okay, there we go, I was gonna say, if we don't get it, that's okay too, oh no, oh no, let me out of here, oh no, oh, oh, we uh, became invisible for a second because of the poison that is on us, Similar to what happens when we got a bunch of sand on us. Okay, but now we can capture one of these guys here because I think there's one nice power moon or so to get over here. You want to go up here, I believe, if I remember correctly. I think it's just right here, right? Yeah, right there. Give me that power moon, please. Thank you very much. Nut in the red maze. Okay, so that's all we want here. Let's pop out of there. Say goodbye to that guy. Oh, no. Now we have to go through the maze. Oh, no. Can we make it out of the maze? I accidentally fell there. I think we might be able to make it back up like this. Yeah, okay, we can do that. Okay, that's nice. Drop down here. Come on over here. I would like to just run to... Over there! I don't know if we can survive this, but... We have an amazing wall jump, so you're able to survive that, despite the mistake. And it's good that, uh... Oh, boy, we're able to make it. oh my goodness, how in the world did I land on this guy over here? Okay, but that's nice that we get this power moon now. These mountains are so nice, guys. I was actually in British Columbia recently for the first time ever. Okay, the date that's showing up over here is wrong. Yes, right now it is the summer of 2023. I was just in Vancouver and Whistler, and oh my goodness, it is absolutely beautiful. The mountains are unreal. I've always wanted to go to mountains. Guys, should I make real life videos? Some people have been asking and encouraging me in the comments to make real life videos going to mountains was just absolutely phenomenal i have some ideas for real life videos that i'd like to make and a lot of people seem to have some uh, interest in that even though this channel is just gaming but it's nice to hear from you guys that you would be interested in that too if you'd be interested in seeing real life videos let me know in a comment let me know what you would like to see i'm curious what people will say maybe we could do videos with my sister too okay so let's step on this p switch now and let's be careful to not die, because we are quite fast. So we can probably go very fast and fall off very easily. Let's see where we're we going. Let's come on up here. 
And can I make it up there? Yes, I can! Oh my goodness, I can't believe we actually reached that. And now where do we want to go? I guess we want to go down this way. Can I just jump down to there? I hope I can reach that. I think we should be able to reach that, right? Where are we going? No! We could have reached it, but we overshot it because we lost control and we were too fast. That is so sad. That was so sad, so sad. We just have to be careful to not be too fast. Hey, but we should be able to make it to there, no problem, right? Go. Oh, man, we bunked, but we made... Wait, wait, we're not in yet. I could have still ran off. I could have still run off. Okay, now, gotta go up this tower here. This tower reminds me slightly, slightly, very, very slightly of Womp's Fortress. But what it also reminds me of... Oh, my goodness! What it also reminds me of is a tower like this in Donkey Kong 64, actually. Okay, so let's see where we want to go. Where do we want to go? Oh, yes, this is where the nut is. Right, right, right. Right, there's a nut with a power moon right here. Perfect. And hold on, after this, how many more do we need? Because we are going to get a multi-moon for defeating the boss. Oh, so we only need one power moon other than that. Okay, so let's go like this. I messed up! I wanted to press the jump button. What in the world happened to my jump button there? Well, I guess we have to go around. We have to take the long way around now. That's all right. Now we just come up here. A little bit slower. That could have been done much more efficiently. Wait! I need the guy, though! Because how am I going to get up there? Oh, no! Oh, no, that is not good. Unless I can somehow get up that high. No, but there's no way that we could reach that high. Our jump is not that good. Okay, where's the guy that we use? The guy that we use is over here. Come! Come! I will capture you. Come! And now we can stretch up here and we can actually get this power moon now that we brought this guy up here. Okay, so that's enough of this guy, so let's pop out of him, and let's run along here. You go so quickly. Even your starting speed when you first start running is really fast. It's not like you go super slow and you accelerate up to a high speed. I also edited your minimum speed. Okay, so how tough is this boss going to be? Shouldn't... Okay, I was gonna say it shouldn't be too bad, but maybe it will be. Okay, so let's see. Come here, come here. I'm gonna jump on you. Come, come. There we go. This is fine. Now just knock your hat off. Jump on him. Okay, very good. Now we just gotta do this one more time. Come here. Come this way, please. Come. Okay. I missed him! I missed him! And I need a heart, I guess. Uh, stay back, stay back. I was gonna say come, but now I'm saying stay back. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. Did I go for that heart over there? Maybe I should go for that heart over there. I'm going for it! Okay, we gotta grab full health. Okay. Now you just go to the center. Go to the center. I'll knock your hat off and jump on your head. Let's go. Go. And now jump on his head. There we go. He is defeated. Okay. Not the most efficient way to defeat the boss. I have defeated this boss more quickly as regular Mario. But we are glad to be done with this kingdom so that we can head out of this kingdom. Because that is all of the power moons that we need. We have enough power moons for this kingdom so we can go to the next kingdom now. All right. So let's get out of this kingdom. Let's put our power moons into the Odyssey. Oh, and it's so cool that there are blue power moons over here. That the power moons are blue. And Sonic is also blue. Kind of reminds me of my video where I gave every character custom colored green stars in Super Mario 3D World. That was a fun video. I should make some more mods like that. It's always fun to make mods of games. Cappy says we now have enough power to make our way to the Metro Kingdom, but for some reason, I don't think that that is going to be happening. I don't think we're going to make it straight to the Metro Kingdom. And while we are waiting in here to make it to the next kingdom as we're flying over, we come over to the window now, and look at this. We look outside, and we can see Bowser's ship up ahead so maybe we'll actually be able to stop Bowser in his tracks and complete the game right now I remember the first time that I ever played this game I actually thought that this might have been the end of the game I was thinking that basically every kingdom since this point would be the end of the game oh yeah that's right it's actually not gonna be Bowser it's gonna be Dr. Eggman I actually forgot about that let's see where's Dr. Eggman come here my eggy friend there he is there he goes his limbs are so funny and I love how his head floats around his body and here's Sonic on the Odyssey with Cappy. So this is going to be a fun kingdom over here. And you know what? I think these boss fights might actually be kind of easy. Let's go. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Yeah, I think that this might actually be an easy boss fight. Oh, man, this looks so cool with Dr. Eggman and Sonic over here. Oh, and he's got the ring also because I guess we didn't uh, get that ring ourselves. Oh, he looks kind of big, doesn't he? That looks like a big Dr. Eggman there. Jim Carrey did a fantastic job playing Dr. Eggman in the Sonic movie. Sonic, I don't have time for you! I'm busy planning my wedding! Don't you know how stressful that is? 
Dr. Eggman's getting married to Peach. What kind of world are we living in today? Oh, and another change that we could have made. We could have replaced Princess Peach with Amy Rose. That could have been cool. Oh my goodness, it looks like he's about to karate chop me. Oh, but he's got a giant hat. Okay, but since we are super fast, I think that this boss fight might actually get easier. That's so funny how his head is floating up there. It's like, he's floating. Or sorry, his head is floating. And then his cap also seems to be floating. Okay, wait, let's grab that hat. There we are. Come here, Bowser, where are you going? Oh, you're going over here? Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna get you! Let's go! Oh man, we're so fast that we can get to him quite quickly. Okay, that was quite easy to do. Where's his head? Oh, I thought that we knocked his head clean off. That's fine, that's fine. Wait, are you gonna breathe fire now? Wait, I don't think that he actually breathes fire now. Let's see, let's just go here. What if I go right up to him like that? Oh no, it went back to him! And I ran into that purple cap. What am I doing? I'm so fast that it is difficult to control. Let's go like this. There we go. Give me this cap. Wait, wait. Well, let's go like this. Nope, I'm taking it. And go! Oh, no, we didn't get him. I was hoping that we'd be able to just get him like that. Uh-oh, uh-oh. This isn't good. This isn't good. But we're so fast we can basically run up to him like this. Where am I going to punch him? Wait, what in the world? Oh, he went flying all the way over there since I was punching him from this side. Okay, where are you going, my friend? Where are you going? What if I come up to him like this? I'm here. What if I just hit it right away? Go! Oh, no, that didn't work. Okay, at least I can run away from them. That's nice. Okay, but grab the hat. Where are you going, bro? Go! Oh, I was hoping that I'd be able to get him right away. Where are you running to, bro? Over here! Over here! This is where you're running to! I'm gonna punch you like this, then. Let's go. Oh, I gotta dodge. Is that all? Okay, it looks like that's all. And there we go. Dr. Eggman has been defeated. Well, defeated for now. Oh, and look at how his head is sunken into his body like that. Basically up to the point of his nose. That's so funny. Okay, and now his head comes out. He's like a turtle in a way. Wait, because Bowser's the king of Koopas, and Koopas are turtles. Oh, where did your head go, Dr. Eggman? He's, he can roar very loudly for someone whose head goes into their body like that. Okay, and cannonballs are being shot at Sonic here. And this almost seems like the kind of thing that you would see in an actual Sonic game, because Sonic does have to face a bunch of giant robots. Dr. Eggman makes a lot of robot bosses. And Princess Peach is calling out after us. All right, Dr. Eggman, you know what? We're gonna stop you. We couldn't defeat you this time, but maybe next time we'll get you. And we are now at the Lost Kingdom, which is a fantastic kingdom. This is a super fun one to speed run. Okay, so Sonic has to get up like that because, yeah, our Odyssey just crashed and we're gonna have to repair the Odyssey. Ah, uh, where are we now? Oh no, the Odyssey's all busted up. Yeah, that's right. We're gonna need some power moons to fix it up. Let's get going. Okay, so let's see. We don't want to accidentally go too far. There's a cool jump that you could do off here, but it might be a bit difficult to do since we're a bit hard to control right now. So let's see. Can I do a double jump? Oh no! Oh no! What happened there? Okay, let's try this. Can I just run and jump off? Go! And we might be able to reach. Oh, man, that's actually so much easier than doing it with Mario. Doing it with this fast Sonic makes it a little bit easier. Okay, and we should be able to get this Power Moon right here. If I can ground pound close enough. There we go. We've got it. Got a nice yellow Power Moon on the mountain road. And then we can get up here also. And wait, hold on. There's this one right here that we want. Let's just get that. Go, Cappy! Go! There we are. Okay, now just don't run off! Oh. Oh. I guess I'm alive. I thought that I would die, actually. What do I do now? Oh, there's a power moon right there. I guess we could go and get that one. Oh, yeah. Let's go for that. Not one of the ones that I was planning on getting, but sure, I guess we could get that. Can I teleport back to the Odyssey now? Because how in the world are we going to get that one that's way up there? I guess so. I wonder if that butterfly is going to still be defeated or if we are going to have to defeat that butterfly again. Let's see. No, the butterfly is back. Okay, so let's just be careful to not accidentally run off when we hit it. Okay, don't run off. Don't run off, Sonic. Just get the power. Move. There we go. Okay, that is fine. You actually have to be careful because otherwise you'll lose control when you're too quick. And you know what? Normally, you want to hit this switch to make these things spawn, but I wonder if we could get up without it. Can we get up high enough? It looks like we actually can make our way up without it, but that will take way too long to do. We'll just go like this just to do it the intended way, because Sonic's wall jump is a bit stronger. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Can I still make it up? Did I miss one? Okay, we can still make it up. That's fine. Okay, very nice. Get that checkpoint. Now let's come on up here, grab that power moon right there. That is a nice one to get. Very lovely. 
Okay, and we only need a few more power moons. We've already got a few. Okay, so we got the one from over there. Let's drop down to one right here. That's perfect that we got that. Atop a propeller pillar. And there's going to be another one right here that you could get for ground pounding this. Let's grab that one. Oh, and we can also take care of that bird because that bird does try to take your cappy. But you know what? Even if our cappy is taken away, not the end of the world. Let's just have this klepto bird come down over there. I think that this might be the same klepto as in Super Mario 64 because they are both called klepto. That's nice that that bird is defeated. Now, head on over there. Where is that? Okay, so at least we respawn from up here. From up here, we should even be able to jump down to it. Okay, we jumped down onto that. That's not what I was expecting to do, but yeah, when you have a high speed like that, when you can move so quickly, uh, the way that you can play is interesting. Oh, 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 and hold on. This bird is back. I guess this bird comes back if you die. Let's just take care of him. Let's go like that. There we go. Now you're gone. Get out of here. Okay, now we can grab this one, maybe. We can come here. Ground pound on that so that we could get the power moon that is in here. Now, after this, I believe we need two more. So... We could get... Oh yeah, we only need two more. Oh yeah, that's right, because there's a different one that we got that I wasn't planning on getting. Okay, come here. Okay, let me make you do that one more time, please. Thank you very much. Now please explode this one. And there we are. Very nice. We got this one. And we only need one more, so we could just get this one right down here. Hopefully without dying. Very nice. And now we can just teleport back to the Odyssey, and we can already go to the next kingdom. That's unbelievable how quick that was. That was a nice and quick kingdom. Now we have enough power moons to restore the Odyssey. And finally, head to the Metro Kingdom. And here we are, it is raining in the Metro Kingdom. All kinds of posters of Bowser's wedding with Peach coming up. And here's Sonic in the rain, coming out of the Odyssey. Guys, these graphics look absolutely amazing. It is so cool to just see Sonic in front of the Odyssey here in the reigning Metro Kingdom. This just looks so good to me. These graphics look unreal. All right, I just took a little here break. Now let's get going. Oh, I actually forgot how quick we were over here. And you know what? Instead of doing something crazy to jump down, let's just try going like this. And we can just make it to the ledge. That is so cool. And we could probably run a lot more quickly than we can use that motorcycle. But you know what? We just want to make our way up here, right? Okay, let's see. How do we make it up here normally? Go like this. And let me up. There we go. Very nice that we made it up there. Okay, that was not bad at all. Now, can I get up here? Oh, I can actually almost get up there. Okay, so let's see. Is there a nice way that we can get to there? You know what? Let's just go like this. And nice. Okay, we made it in here. Now, just let me up here, please. And give me that power moon. Okay, amazing that we got that power moon. Girder sandwich, very nice. Now let's just come on up here. Oh man, the way that we're moving around is so easy. It's a bit easier to move around when your stats are adjusted like this. I made Sonic much faster and I made his wall jump stronger. So it's nice that we can move around like this. And can I just get that power moon right there? Let's get it. Where are you, bro? We got it. Are we falling now? Are we falling now? Let me go there. Oh. Wait, in the world, how in the world do I get back up now? Oh no, oh no, these guys are coming to me. I'm gonna hide back here. Ha, you can't get me back here. Oh, we just gotta come here. Now let's just take this right on back up. Those Goombas with the construction hats look so cool with the hard hats. Okay, let's come over here and get in here. This section might actually be difficult when we are quicker than normal. This section I remember being incredibly tough in... Super Mario Odyssey, but Shadow Clones are chasing you. That was way too hard. That was actually one of the hardest things I've ever done in this game. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I want to stay away from these guys. Stay back. Stay back. Okay, good. Now come on to this one. Where are you? Okay, looks like we're coming back here. Get up. Come over here. Go. Let me there. Okay, that's all right. Come here. Okay, now get onto this one. Stay back. Stay back, monsters. Stay back. Stay back, monsters. Stay back, creatures. Stay back. Stay back. All of you must stay back. Stay back. Don't knock me up. Don't knock me up. Go. Okay, I have one HP only. A bit scary. Do I want to climb up here? Where do I want to go? I want to go over there, don't I? Hopefully, we can survive this. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Make your way up. Make your way up. Okay, now I want to make it onto that one. Okay, climb on up. 
I'll come here. Now I can just go like this, right? That'll be fine. I can get this power moon here. Don't kill me! Don't kill me, bro! Don't kill me, bro! Don't kill me, bro! Don't kill me, bro! Kill me, bro. Yeah! Alright, and we got the power moon, so the power moon heals us also. And I think from here, whoops, you should also be able to just run and jump to there, right? Where's the wall that we want to land on? Oh my goodness, I jumped back to the beginning. Can you believe it? To the very, very beginning. Instead of the exit, we jumped to the very beginning. Go! Stay back! Okay, at least those Goombas are finally defeated now. That's nice. Now then, are there going to be more Goombas over here causing trouble? Get back, you little troublemakers. You little munchkins. You little munchkin Goombas. Okay, there we go. Took care of that. Stay back, you little munchkins. Stay back, you little munchkins. Little munchkins, you gotta stay back. Okay, let's come up here. And hold on, it's saying that we want to go here. Okay, let's go like this then. Get the thing. Okay, good, good, good. We grabbed the pole. That's nice. Climb on up. Now, you know what? This time, we're gonna continue across this way. No! Sonic, no. No, no, no. It's so hard to control you sometimes, Sonic. What if I just come up? If we do this. This is where we were last time, right? Go here, come on up, grab that, okay, that's all right, go here, and here, grab the pole, climb on up, but I just want to make it out of this room, let's make it out of this room, let's go, let's go, let's go, there's somewhere that we've got to go, right, right, you guys are little troublemakers, so I'm going to run past all of you, look out, look out my bros, and just let me out of here, there we go, now, we're almost at the boss, I think that we just have to ride up to the boss now, right? Just from here? I think that might be right. Let's see. Yeah, here we are. This should be the boss up here. That'll be very nice. Let's go. I'm ready to battle you. Look at that Mecha Wiggler sucking out all the energy from that tower. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Okay, we want to shoot you basically everywhere. And come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. We got it. We got it. Okay, now let's damage it. Let's go. And... There we go, those were some nice hits. It's nice that we were able to do that. Okay, now let's just hide in the corner over here so that hopefully the paths that it takes aren't too long. Okay, that isn't really the corner. That's okay, where are you going next? You're going... What the? How did you hurt me? How did you hurt me? I will shoot you now, even though that does nothing. That's okay, you just go through there. I guess don't stand too close to the wall because you could get hurt. You know you're going to come out again. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Come on out. Now, where are you going? Where are you going, my little wormy, wormy friend? You're coming here. You're coming here. I'm prepared to battle. I'm prepared to battle. I shall attack you in a moment. Okay, come. No, 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 We have only one HP. Are you defeated? Are you defeated? What else do I have to hit? What else do I have to hit? Up there? No, I didn't get the head. Did that count? Did that count? Yes, 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 yes. Please tell me it's defeated. Yes! We had a quick victory against the boss. Thank goodness. Oh boy, I actually haven't done that in a while, but that's very nice that we were able to do that. Ah, oh, that was so nice and quick how we were able to defeat it. That might have been the fastest that I've ever defeated that boss, actually. But now we get this multi moon. I really hope that my game doesn't crash here and I have to redo this boss because after some of these boss fights, my game sometimes crashes when we collect the multi moon or the power moon and then I have to redo it. But. It looks like we are okay. Hopefully we are okay. Come on, because it... Okay, it's been a white screen for a while. I was a little scared over there. But there we are. It's Sonic in the Metro Kingdom. Wait. Okay, thank goodness. Yeah, it's now daytime in the Metro Kingdom. All right, let's go and collect some Power Moons. So there's one to collect right in here. We just got to drop in here, collect that Power Moon. Very nice. Secret Girder Tunnel. A nice one to collect right at the start like that. Wait a minute. Do I really have that many Power Moons? I don't remember collecting this many Power Moons. Sure, we got a few, but that seems like we really have a lot of power moons, doesn't it? Okay, so it's so nice that we can just run over to that like that. Okay, now this one will take a little bit of time to do. Wait, is this normally here? The world is this under construction, because that's normally where the Mario letters are, but I guess that's under construction right now. Okay, let's see if we can do this. How does this work? Do we know how to control the car? Go like that. Now back up this way. Yeah! All right! I'm so glad that that worked! Okay, that was perfect. All right, look at how good my driving is. That's fantastic. Okay, let's, go. let's get out of here. And we want to bounce up here, because there are one or two power moons that we should be able to get up here. We can go here and go ground pound in this garbage here. Ground pound right there in that pile of garbage. There's a nice power moon for us. Lovely. Who piled garbage on this? We already have 
almost half of all the power moves that we need now. We should be able to flick ourselves over straight to that bench right there. Oh, I was hoping that we'd land right on the bench because that's the most efficient way to do it, but we landed on the guy and said, you're not from around here, are you? No, I'm Sonic. You're the first person to ever just sit down next to me. I'm not really a person. Lonely City, thanks for reaching out. Take this for your trouble. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. We got a power moon. Bench friends instead of best friends. Thanks, pal. Yeah, not a problem, bro. Let's go in here. We could get the power moon here. It's also so cool how we could run through this city so quickly. Okay, 10 coins. Let's play. Let's play. Let's try and win the power moon. Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. We're gonna get on the first try. Ready? After the heart. Go. Ah, I didn't get it. Go. Yeah, there we go. Okay, at least we didn't fail. We didn't grab all of them all together. But at least we didn't fail. That's what's important. Okay, so we got this power moon. Now we can get out of here. It's 11 power moons. We need 20. So we are making nice progress through the city. Let's see. Do we want to go here? I vaguely remember that we want to go here. We should be able to get a few power moons, I think. Oh, this is the one where we have to rush. So let's just go like this. And we are so fast. That we can make it through that crowd and get that power moon very, 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 very quickly. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of time still before that starts to disappear. So let's see. Where can we go next? Let's bounce up here. Can I just... Oh, let's jump roll. over like this and give me that power moon. Okay, there we go. There's another nice power moon high over the crowd. And you know what? Let's go over to this pipe here and we'll go through this pipe too. Sonic is so much faster than the people. Okay, so there should be one or two nice power moons that we could get here. We'll see how long they take because there are still a few power moons that we need. I just jumped straight to the end there. That'd be so cool if we could just jump straight to the end there. Let's see. This is where I do all of my training. All right, sir. Well, let's see how good our training will be here. And... Ah, oh, that's so... Oh, I was going to say that's so cool, but we jump past the power moon. Okay, that's very nice. Hanging from a high rise. And then there is also one up high somewhere that you want to get. But you know what? I'm happy with these. Let's teleport to the rooftop because there are a few nice ones up there. Let's... see. We want to go up higher, so I guess... Oh, wait, but first there is that power moon right... Here, that we can get. It's so funny that I just did a regular jump over to it. Normally, you want to throw Cappy and then do a spinning long jump to it. But we're able to just go like that! Okay, that didn't work. Okay, but that's all right. We can go like this. Now, we can come on up to here because that is where we wanted to go, anyways, because we have to get up high here so that we could climb up this. Okay, that's not how you grab it, Sonic. That's okay, though. Try again, Sonic. Please try again. Come on up. There we go. Now we can climb on up. Get up! Bro! What are you doing? Okay, there we go. Now we can climb on up. Get the power moon. Wait, did Sonic just make a weird sound? I'll have to listen to that again. Okay, now we, of course, want to go over this way. And that power moon right there, that's so funny how he just flew right into it. Oh, and I guess... Maybe this would have been a shortcut, but we probably could have just jumped straight down to that rocket down there. Okay, now... What do we want to ground pound around here? Is that it? No, I missed it! Lately, I've always been landing right on it. But, oh, okay, we're off by a bit that way. Okay, that's fine. Wait, do we only need two more power moons now? We've almost got all of them. Okay, so you know where we could get two more power moons? There are two nice power moons that we could get. Okay, so let's go like this. Let's talk to Mayor Pauline, because Mayor Pauline will say, Hey, I need some musicians. Now, when we talk to a musician, we're going to ignore that drummer there. You know what? Instead of taking that path, let's do a cooler path. Since we are Sonic and we are cool and we can jump high. And we could run fast. Run up these stairs here. And let's get up here. And I think that maybe we could just... Oh, actually, maybe we won't be able to make it. Nope. We could almost make it. No, but our wall jump doesn't take us higher. We're going lower and lower instead of going higher and higher. I think we're gonna die now. Goodbye, Sonic. Oh, cool. We actually respawn up here. I actually did want to respawn up here. I don't know if this would make the jump easier or more difficult. Let's see. Let's try our best. Run. Jump. Can we reach? We might be able to make it. We made it from up there on the roof. That is pretty cool. Okay, so we can get a power moon right here from this. And we can talk to that musician and he'll give us a final power moon. And then we can just teleport to the Odyssey after that. Because this guy, after we talk to him and after... Wait, he said, why the serious face, pal? I'm Sonic, that's why. Okay, now 
we can just teleport back to the Odyssey. And we can head on over to the next kingdom. Oh, it's such a cool kingdom. The Metro Kingdom has to be the favorite kingdom of a lot of people. Guys, let me know in a comment what your favorite kingdom is. I'm curious. I'm not just comment farming. I actually want to know what answers people will give. Okay, let's see where we are going next. Do we have two options? Oh, yes, we do have two options. Okay, so is it... Uh, Snow and seaside. Okay, let's go to snow first. So here we are, the snow kingdom. There's a big snowstorm here. It's a very fitting name for the kingdom. Oh, and you know what? I wonder. Okay, Sonic is a bit invisible in this kingdom because of all the snow that is on him. But hold on, hold on. There's a jump up to somewhere back there. Yeah, can we make it to there? I don't know if we can make it to there. Nope, there's no way that we can make it to there. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's just slide down here. Let's make our way out of the cold water because we don't want Sonic to freeze. Sonic is so cold that his body just disappeared even. Okay, now hold on. Where's the toad? There's a toad somewhere around here. Oh, is this where the toad is? Yeah, we can find the toad so quickly because we can move so quickly. Okay, so just give us the power moon, please, Mr. Captain Toad. Thank you very much. Captain Toad is chilly. Yeah, so that's one power moon collected. Okay, so let's get going to over there because I guess this is where we're going to have to go now. Let's just get that and let's drop down here. And the music that plays in this place is pretty cool also. Got some cool music playing here. Now, we want to make it up here. This would be a nice place to go get that power moon. That is nice. Entrance to Shiveria. Oh, and we can also buy a power moon here. Oh, and first, can we get up here like this? Let's see. Let me up here. Perfect. Now let me get that power moon. Very nice. That's a nice and easy way to get that one. That is absolutely lovely. Wait, wait, wait. But before we continue back down, let's just go this way while we are here. Okay. I've never done this with the camera facing this way before. This is so strange. Whoa. Okay. Now we've got snow on us. Hold on. Where's this shiny spot? There's this shiny spot. It's weird. It's almost like we're so fast that the camera can't keep up with us or something because I haven't seen those camera angles before. That was quite strange. Okay, so now we can head in here to the shop. Let me into the shop, please. I'd like to go into the shop, please. Now that we are in the shop. Okay, we're so fast that we basically ran right up them. I really want this power moon so quickly that I'm even standing on this table here. Oh, and it's funny that they say welcome mustached friend, even though Sonic doesn't have a mustache, does he? Yeah, it doesn't look like Sonic has a mustache. So that's kind of funny that they say to him, welcome mustached friend. Okay, so now we can start to get some of these power moons over here. So let's see what this one is. Is this the poison floor area? Yes, it is. Okay, let's see. Jump by here. Then go, oh, I'm dead! Blown in such a strange way there. I've never been blown like that before. That was some of the strangest blowing I had ever experienced. Okay, now where we want to go is up here, of course, so that we can ground pound on that and get this power moon, which will be very lovely. And then we just want to head over there and defeat those finies. It'd be nice to defeat them. Okay, nice, 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 and very nice. So glad that we got this guy. Okay. Now let's just blow off these spinies. Hey there, spinies. Gonna push you all off here. Now we can get that power moon there. That'd be awfully lovely, wouldn't it? We could just go and get that power moon there. All right. There we are. Now after this, we only need three more. Okay, so let's just go down this pipe and should I go top left bottom right let's see because we only need three more so let's see where we are going to go let's go in here is this the up high one where there's the boss yeah it is so you know what I don't really care too much for this one let's go to the other rooms let's let's go to this room and yes over here we'll be able to get these quite quickly there we go it's a piece of a power moon give me that please do that, please. Okay, where's the other one? One is right there. Now, where's the final one? Where's the final piece? Oh, it's just right over here. Perfect. Okay, so we should be able to get the power moon that's going to be up at the top. And we can also get the treasure chest that is up there because that is where the next power moon that we need is going to be. And then after that, we only need one more. Please boost me up. I don't know if I even need your boost, but I will take your boost. Okay, boost me up, please. Thank you. Boost me up. You know, I'll come over this way first, actually. I love how quickly you can go sideways like that. It's quite fun. Okay, now climb on up. Get this one, please. Thank you very much. And after this, we only need... Well, after this, we need two more. We just have to get... This one that is here, please don't miss. Thank you, Sonic. Okay, and after this, we only need one more power moon. Okay, so now we could go... This bottom right one over here. Now, what is this going to be? Oh, yes, yes, yes. I know where we could go. I just go straight to that. Let's see. Go! And... 
That's so funny. We could just go straight to that. That was a great power move to get. Okay, so now let's just teleport back to the Odyssey and let's go to the Seaside Kingdom. That was a nice and quick kingdom. Oh, oh, and that's right. Sonic's basically invisible because when he gets snow on him, there isn't a model for Sonic having snow on him. So he kind of turns invisible like that. So next up is the Seaside Kingdom. And it's so cool how we basically go around the whole world like this, exploring all kinds of different areas. Oh, and Sonic's still basically invisible there. Here we are, the Seaside Kingdom. Quite the contrast to the previous kingdom, which was the Snow Kingdom. Now, it is time for us to go and collect some power moves. Let's just make it into that pipe. It's a bit hard to aim. You know, over here was the power move. Whoops, that's not where I wanted to go. I wanted to go around here. Is that right? Nope, not here. Oh, there it is. Okay, it looks like that was the right spot, roughly. We just had to move over a bit, and we're kind of invisible because we have some sand on us right now. Okay, so now... Let's just, oh, 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 and we should be able to make it up here. Let's see if we can do this. Whoa, give me up there and give me that. Let me have the power move. Where is that? That's okay. We'll just try again and we'll get it this time, right? Where are you? Where are you, power move? Depth-wise, where in the world are you, bro? Give me that. Where are you? Where in the world is this power move? There we go. I saw my own shadow on it. Well, I guess not my own shadow. It was Sonic's shadow on it. So I thought, okay, we can't miss it this time. Let's come on down. Now, let's see. Oh, don't run off. Don't be too quick, Sonic. Don't be too eager over here. You want to head up this way, which is nice. And now, if we could just make it up there, that'd be lovely. But I'm not sure if we can get up like this. Yeah, of course we can get up because we have got an amazingly powerful wall jump. And if this was Super Mario Odyssey with Flood, then we could just float over to there. But this is not Super Mario Odyssey with Flood. This is Super Mario Odyssey with Sonic. So, you have to act slightly differently here. You know what? Let's take this rocket because there might be one or two nice power moves that we could get here. Wait. No, we can't jump to there, right? We can't make it that far. I don't think we can make it that far. No, there's no way that we can make it that far. Yeah, we can barely even make it to here. I'm lucky that there was ground there because I'm not sure where the ground is because I actually haven't taken the ground in a while. Okay, so we want to go over there. Don't hurt me, my bros. Oh, no. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. No, I'm not. I'm dead. No. Okay, let's try this again. Let's just be careful with where we can and can't go. Can we go down there? I'm hoping that we can. It looks like there's a little bit of ground over here, but where we want to go is in here because there's a treasure chest with a nice power moon for us. Now, we actually have to make it out of here. It's so weird when you actually... Whoa, no, I'm dead again! Yeah, it is so weird when you actually have to... Wait, can I land here? Thank goodness I can land there. I almost died again. Okay, but it is very nice to just go somewhere. I can land here, I think. Okay, let's go like this then. Okay, that is fine. Give me the power moon, please. Thank you very much. Now we can make it out of here. I don't think those were the most efficient power moons and I don't think that we got them in the most efficient way but let's get out of here so a nice one to get could also be this one right here I don't think this one should be very difficult and hold on normally this rocket flower is supposed to boost you so that you go quicker than normal but I think it actually makes us go more slowly than normal since right now Sonic goes very very quickly anyways that's nice that we got that one now let's see where we can go next let's go over here because I think there are one or two or so power moons that we could get over here. Can I buy a power moon from you, please? Hello there. Hello. Oh, I'd like to buy a power moon, please. Can I buy a power moon, please? Welcome, my friend. Yes, I'd like to buy this power moon, please. Thank you very much. I'll take that. Don't crash. Okay, good. Okay, let's go and get some other power moons. Oh, it's so nice how we could run so quickly, but it's funny that when you start swimming, all of a sudden you're so slow. But when you do jumps like this, I guess you do move kind of quickly also. Let's just watch out for these. Watch out for these! Watch out for those! Now, where can we go and get some more power moons? I guess we have to go down into the water, because there are probably some power moons that we could get around here. Let's see, any cheap cheeps around? I'd like to catch a cheap cheap, please. There's a cheap cheap right here. Get the cheap cheap! There we are, we are now the cheap cheap. Let's go. And can we... Can we come here? Wait, I've got to... Shake the controller! Shake the controller! Anything here? Okay, not seeing anything here. Let's go like... Oh, don't hurt me! Where's this spot? Is this what we need? Nope, nothing here. Wait, this Dory doesn't just have a power moon, does it? 
There is a power moon just under its belly. Okay, that's nice. Okay, let's just take that then. That's a nice one for us. Merci, Dory. Okay, and we should be able to just swim over here because there's a treasure chest right here for us with the power moon. Let's just get that one. Now we only need one more. Glass Palace treasure chest. Let's go, let's go, 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 go. Well, you know what? Maybe I could go this way because maybe there's actually something over here. Is there anything this way? Let's see, okay, purple coins there. Look out! I bumped into them. Okay, there's a shiny spot here. This isn't gonna be a power moon, is it? No, I don't think this is. No, those guys just come out. That's okay. Wait, could this be the one? That's a shiny spot. This isn't gonna be the power moon, is it? Is it? Yes, it is! Okay, that's perfect. Now we can just get out of here. Under a dangerous ceiling. Yeah, that ceiling does look a bit dangerous. All those seaweed creatures there, but. We can just go back to the Odyssey now, because we're done with this kingdom. Another kingdom complete. So now we can put these ten power moons in here, and we're almost done with the game. We're getting close to finishing the game. Can you guys believe it? There's Luncheon Kingdom, then I believe it's Ruined Bowser and Moon. Unless there's something else that I'm forgetting, but I think that might be it. Alright, so let's go to the Luncheon Kingdom. That is what is next. And this one that's coming up is a pretty long kingdom. There are quite a few power moons that you have to get. But we might be able to make it through it kind of quickly. Uh, and there's also a lot of lava floor there. Here we are, the Luncheon Kingdom. That pink gooey stuff is lava. You get burned if you land on that. Alright, let's go collect some power moons in... The Luncheon Kingdom now that we're here. I'm so glad we didn't bunk there. I thought we might bunk there. Okay, I am a bit fast over here. Make sure that we can... Control ourselves here. Come on up and just do a dive into it. There we go. What a lovely power moon that we got. Our first power moon. Luncheon Kingdom Timer Challenge Hunt. Well, our first power moon in this... This kingdom, I should say. Okay, is Cappy coming back? There's Cappy. And the way that you normally get up here is you can do a nice... You do a nice triple jump from here, but instead we can go like that to get up easily. And Oh, wait. Why did I do a long jump? I actually forgot that long jumps slow us down compared to how quickly we're normally running. Okay, so let's see. Where else can we get a power moon? I think there's going to be one in... Here, that's a lovely place to go and grab a power moon. And the way that we're moving around is really cool too. We can move nice and quickly. Okay, let's just get on up here. And I guess now we'll have a battle against this brutal. Oh, and it's Spewert again, right? Yeah, that's right. Okay, so let's just bounce on him! Bounce on him! Where is your head? Okay, okay, that's all right. That's fine. Let's just stay calm, everybody. That's fine. This is all right. Let's just jump there. There we go. Very nice. This is going great. Now just throw Cappy. Now just jump on his head. There we go. See? Don't things go so well when you just stay calm? Now let's just go like that. Jump on him. And there we go. Not a problem. Let's just throw Cappy here. Jump on his head. Now jump on his head. Just it's fine. It's fine. All right. There we go. I was ready to scream if he damaged us again. But there we go. Spirit has been defeated. Goodbye, Spirit. And we can, of course, now collect... Power Moon! And now we'll have some more stuff in the level spawn. We can continue through the level and get more Power Moons. So, hold on. Where's that Power Moon? There's a Power Moon around here somewhere that we want. Don't run off. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, I think we want to go down here because there's the one in here. I almost forgot about this, actually. Now, all we have to do is just run around the corner like this and grab that. And then we can just run back. Corner of the Magma Swamp. Magma Swamp sounds like a very dangerous biome, doesn't it? Could you imagine being in a Magma Swamp? Regular Swamp is dangerous enough, but oh boy, a Magma Swamp! That is so cool that we made that jump up there, though. Let's just run on up here. Hold on, where's the shiny spot? There's a shiny spot somewhere around here, isn't there? Is it here, or is it one of the earlier ones? No, I guess these don't have the shiny spots. Okay, so it's just... We want to go up here. And this one. There's another pillar like that that we do want to ground pound, but that is somewhere else, I believe. If I'm not mistaken. Okay, overlooking a bunch of ingredients. Now, just come down here. We haven't been into this house yet, so let's do this. Okay, let's play the game. I'm ready to play the game. Ten coins to play. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm ready. Let's go. Slots away. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. After hearts. Let's go. Oh, boy. We barely got to go. Oh, man. We still got it. I thought both times that I would mess up, but both times we did get it. That is absolutely amazing. Okay, now let's just run out of here. Okay, so what is next? I guess there's a spot up here that we can head up to, and then we can... Throw Cappy here, break that, and now we can just collect this power moon because that gives us a lovely power moon. So let's just jump here, 
There, we are very nice that we got that. Is this an ingredient too? In a way it is. Now where's the shiny one that we want to land on? Oh, it's right there. Let's just jump over to this one. And right there we can get ourselves a power moon. Wait, that's so weird! The bird is in the O of the word moon there! That was such a funny placement of the camera, isn't it? Okay, now we want the center one, I believe. Yeah, let's get the center one. And throw that in there. And now we'll be able to get the power moon that is right here. Or is it on the other side or the center? Oh, it's over there. Okay, so we're off by a little bit, but there we go. That's ten power moons collected now, isn't it? Yes. Ten power moons have been collected, so it looks like we need approximately eight more. So let's see, can I jump over to there from here? I don't think so, actually, so maybe we should try and get up here. Oh wait, can I buy a power moon here? I don't really have a lot of money, so maybe that won't be a good idea, actually. No! I felt, you know what, that's it, I'm going here now. That's it. You guys are forcing me to do this! Come! Come! There we go, don't hit me with your frying pan! Let's come on up, come on up. Let's break this here, okay, let's pop on out. Where are you? There we go, now we can throw that. Now that's going to break open for us. Now we can just run over there and collect that power moon, can't we, right? right. Whoa, look at us go already. And there we go, we've got this power moon and that's splendid. We're making some progress here. Okay, so now this is all coming up here. You know what? You know what? Parts of the level coming up from under the goop over here? This actually reminds me so much of Bowser's Fury because in Bowser's Fury, there are a bunch of levels that come up out of the lake. Okay, let's come here so we could light that up. Thank goodness we got it. Okay, and let's drop down. I don't want to climb up into the fire by accident. Oh, and don't touch me. I fell down into the fire and I'm burned. And now we are invisible because we are a bit burnt. But at least we are healed. Let's be careful. Oh, and that was weird. The spiny's face was in the O of you got a moon. What's going on with all this lucky placement that we have? Okay, let's come here because there's a power moon that we need around here somewhere. Where is it? It's right... Oh boy! Don't die, Sonic. Alright! Thank goodness we didn't fall in there. Okay, that's amazing. Okay, so let's grab this one. There's another nice power moon for us. Surrounded by tall mountains. Okay, so it looks like we need about how many more? Five more. So we could get two more, and then after that, we could just get the multi moon. So let's try for that. So let's see what way we can go. Let's go over here. It's so nice that you could just easily jump back like this. Okay, and I almost fell off there, which would have been quite bad, actually. Oh! can't wall jump against that corner, I guess, but you can here, which is fine. So let's go here. Flick me up. Flick me up. Beautiful. Oh, don't bonk. Okay, that's fine. We bonked. Okay, get the checkpoint flag. Okay, that's fine. So we'll get that one in a moment. But first, there are two more power moons that we need. So you know what? Maybe can we go get something nice around here? Is there just a power moon up high here? Or is there a uh, you-know-what that we have to bring over? They're a turnip that we have to bring over from here. Let's see, get me up here. Oh, it's just the power moon! No, we bonked, that is so sad, so sad everybody. Everyone please comment, so sad! Okay, but that's nice that we got that Goomba there. Okay, and I think normally this, I don't know if this normally would be possible, but we can just jump up nicely like that. There's also a gold turnip. Should I bring over that gold turnip or should I go that way and get that power moon over there? Oh, you know what? There should actually be a relatively easy one around here. I just gotta get a lava bubble. Where can I get a lava bubble around here? I need a lava bubble. Give me a lava bubble. Give me a lava bubble. Come here. Go! Get it! Okay, nice. We got it. We got it. We got it. Now, can I get out here? Or wait, is there a spot that we could ground pound on up there? Or is that only a post-game move? Well, anyways, let's just go get this one because this will be a fine one to get this one right over here. And let's just get all these music notes. Very nice. Come on now. Come on. Come on, baby. Don't miss any. I missed one. Go get it. I missed two. But we got him. Even though I got burnt. Well, hold on, hold on. We didn't get the moon yet. Wait. Wait. And go. Yes. We've got it. Okay. That's actually amazing. Okay. So now we should just be able to get the multi-moon. I'll get this checkpoint flag just in case we need it. I don't think we will need it. Let's teleport up to meet Plateau, and then we should be able to get the multi-moon easily, and then we'll be able to get out of this kingdom. Okay, this is a white screen for a long time. But there we go. Now we are where we need to be. Let's just come on up here. Press B to use Twitch a lot, and I don't mean Twitch like the live streaming service that is now owned by Amazon. I mean, we are a twitching slab of meat. And that's what the bird wants, so the bird is gonna come down and grab us and go bring us into the soup. Okay, and now we are here, so now we 
oh, should yeah. just, oh nice, so we can just do a die very easily into that power boom. So there we go, that is absolutely perfect. So now it is just Ruined Kingdom, then Bowser Kingdom, then Moon Kingdom. So we're almost done, which is fantastic. Okay, so Cappy's now gonna say, hey, we can go to the Bowser Kingdom, but there's a big wing over there. So we are going to the Ruined Kingdom first. We're gonna be attacked on the way. Or do we run into that? Oh no, I think we actually do get attacked. Oh, we're getting attacked again. What? Are we shaking? Why? And we come out and look what, oh yeah, and it's not gonna be Bowser, it's gonna be Dr. Eggman. I actually forgot about that. Yeah, so there's Dr. Eggman on top of this big dragon over here. Where in the world did Dr. Eggman get a dragon like that? Does that mean that the dragon is mechanical and not a real dragon? Because Dr. Eggman, he often uses a lot of giant robots and whatnot. Let's see you survive this plumber boy. Why are you calling Sonic Plumber Boy? Sonic isn't a plumber boy. And let's see what happens when Sonic gets attacked. Oh my goodness, we are getting zapped. And down we go. Oh, uh, that dragon has a big smile. Hey, wouldn't you know it, the Odyssey is broken again. Yeah, how many times is that going to happen? I've never been to Dark Side or Darker Side yet, so I wonder if that will happen there. Soon I should get to that. I should get there in my main playthrough. It's funny that I've now played Here so many mods of this game. Oh, and I think this boss fight is actually going to be incredibly easy since we are so fast. Uh, any of these electric rings that come towards us, we can just easily, very, very easily outrun them, actually. This we can just run over here. Where are you guys going? Oh boy. That was actually a little bit scary. Okay, let's be careful here. Where are we going? It looks like you do want to make a few jumps over here. And let me up here, please. Don't bonk. Okay, grab that. Grab that. And that. Now just ground pound. There we go. What a lovely ground pound. That first, when I was first doing this boss, I thought you had to get a lot closer for the ground pound. But it looks like you actually don't have to get too close, which is nice. Let's just stay back here. None of you can reach me. Aha! Nice try, rings. Get some more electric rings here. I can just outrun them. It's so easy to outrun them when you can move so quickly like this when you're Sonic. And now we are going to want to get close in a moment. Let's go! 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 And go! And go! Okay, there we go. That's all those. Now ground pound. Perfect! That's what we like to see. Now just one more hit like that, and then the dragon will be defeated. Hopefully we can do all right. Okay, you're attacking over there? That's fine. I'll just stand right here. And... Oh! Oh, lots of those rings. How many rings are coming out? Is that more than usual? I didn't think that those attacks normally worked like that. What in the world is going on? Now you're just falling over here. That seemed a bit different from normal. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no. I want to get up here. Go. Go. Go, get that one. Good. Go. Go. And go. Now, just round pound. There we go, and we had plenty of time to do that. That's fantastic. We did take a hit of damage, unfortunately. But other than that, the boss was fantastic. Look at those teeth. Look at those big chompers that this dragon has. Okay, let's get that multi-moon now. And hopefully my game doesn't crash. Go! Hooray! Sonic gets to dance around. Oh, this is now Super Sonic Galaxy. Isn't there a game called Sonic Superstars or Sonic All-Stars that's coming out soon? I'll have to check that out. I do need to finish Sonic Origins. And I've also heard amazing things about Sonic Mania. I would like to play those. I've got to play some more Sonic games. I didn't even finish Sonic Frontiers. All right, so now that that boss has been defeated, we can now go to the next kingdom, which is the Bowser Kingdom. We're actually going to the Bowser Kingdom now. Can you believe it? Here we are. We are now at the Bowser Kingdom. And just like in my earlier video in Super Mario Odyssey, the one that I was making a reference to earlier. Okay, please open door because I'm too fast for you. Goodbye Goombas, I'd just like to run past you all and come over here because we are very fast, we are Sonic, we are just running past everybody essentially. Okay, let's go! I wanted to whack you like this and get you quickly. Okay, come on up, come on up. Now hold on, do I have to stick my nose in here somewhere? I think I have to stick my nose in here. Oh no, you don't! For some reason I was thinking that there's a slot to stick your nose into here, but there isn't. This one is just a power moon just to collect just like that. That was fine. Okay, now let's come on up, let's pop on out of that guy. Come on up this way, go! And bring me up now, please. Thank you very much. That was a nice power moon to get there. And you know what? Let's go like this. Since I can move quickly, I should be able to just collect all these right away, shouldn't I? Whoa! And, okay, we actually did get them surprisingly quickly. I thought that'd be much more difficult, and I thought that I would accidentally run into the spinies a lot more. That was fine that we got that. Now let's just run along this way. Now we have to defeat this guy. Okay, try and squish me. I can just move. And I can easily get up onto your head 
and ground pound you here. That defeats you, and that lets us have a power moon here, right? Am I gonna get the power moon? I'll put down my controller. I'll put it down, my controller's down, and we were in the place of the power moon, so we got to have it, which is nice. And now another door is opening for us, and there are going to be some things that we have to do here. I wonder, wait, 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 is this where the power moon is? Oh, the power moon isn't back here. Okay, because there's one door that you kind of pass through like that. And shortly after that, there is a, uh, you know what, that you could get a power moon that you could get. Okay, now hold on, hold on, because this is now a point where we are going to have to collect all of these. We don't want to miss out on these. Let's just go like this. Bring me along here. Thank you very much. I'd like to come up here, please. Please let me up. All right. Guess we're not coming up there then. Not today. Not today. In fact, not yesterday. Not tomorrow either. Let's go. Get this fella over here. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Okay, now let's explode that one there. How about you? I'll explode that one there. Let's stick my nose in here, because that gives us a power moon. That's a lovely power moon, isn't it? Just to get that power moon, I think. Okay, poking the turret wall. So this is number three, as in power moon shard number three, I believe. Okay, so there are two more that we have to get. There's one here, and hold on, there's one that's kind of by a uh, fire. Wait, it's not all the way back there, is it? It is all the way back there. We didn't get this one here yet. Okay, let's grab that. Okay, nice! And Cappy got it on the way back, which is fantastic. And it's nice that we are so fast, because even though we had to run all the way over here because we forgot about this, we can still just run up like this and get back where we have to go very quickly like that, which is nice. Too bad that dive didn't get us right into the power moon. We still had to do a jump. Oh, Sam. Okay, it actually seems like we are going through these kingdoms somewhat quickly now. And hold on, do we need this power moon here? Let's see. Let me up here, please. Very nice that we got that, okay. From the side above the castle gate. Now let's just jump down. Where's that? There it is. Good thing we didn't die. Okay, now let's get moving. We want to go to here. Wait, if you shake the controller, do you move more quickly? It seemed like we were moving very, very quickly there, actually, because I shook the controller instead of moving the joystick. It seemed like we moved very quickly when we did that. Okay, but there should be a checkpoint flag right here. And now there are going to be two bosses to take on. Guys, do you remember when we faced this boss near the beginning of the game? Go so like that, okay. Now hold on, which one are you going to be in? You are in this one right. No, 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 I meant this one. I missed it, I missed it. Okay, he's up there, top left. Go. No! He's right there, he's right there, he's this one. This one right here. I'm trying to get it. There we go, that's the one. Yes, I knew that was the one. Let's go. Okay, let's just keep knocking your hats off. And... Come here, come here, you little wabbit. You ask we little wabbit. All right, where are you going now? I think he might be this one. Oh yes, I was right. Yay. Oh no, I've got to run. Oh, now I can just run away quickly. That's the super nice thing about... um. Being so quick. Uh-oh, uh-oh. You can easily run away if you need to. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And... Get him. There we go. Okay, this boss has been defeated. That is absolutely fantastic. But we have only two HP right now, so that might be a little scary to take on the next boss. Hey, one of these Bowser statues are defeated. That's absolutely fantastic. Can we reach the next one without touching the ground? Go! Yeah, there we go. Oh, and we actually haven't faced this boss in our playthrough yet, which is kind of funny. Okay, so now let's move back a little bit. Go like that! My game lagged. That was so silly. Okay. Let's just be careful. Like this. And that should get you. Now I can jump on your head. Where's your head? Give me your head, you little rabbit. Oh my goodness. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. I have one HP. I have only one HP. This is very scary. I could die quite easily, I think. Okay, where are you going? Going here. Going there. Get it. Okay, I am quite fast, but I have to be able to control my Cappy. That's the only problem. And I have one HP. That's the other problem. Let's go like this. That'll get you. Oh, don't die. Oh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Because that fire was right there. Okay, that was a little scary. Okay, now where are you going? Don't run into the bomb. But get it. Oh, no. Get it. Get it! I'm so scared. Oh, boy. These are being dropped down everywhere. Okay, just go like that. Oh, no. You're coming down already. Okay. All right. This might be bad. This might be bad. You know what? I'm just going to send those away because I don't like being here. I don't like being here. I don't want to run into the fire. I don't want to run into the fire. Hey, get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready. Go back. So send that. That's missing. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm standing back. I'm standing back. Please don't reach me. Let's go. Hit it. Hit it. There we go. Okay, now can I get your head, you little rabbit? Give me your head, you little rabbit. There we go. I was so worried because we had only one HP. Any little hit would have killed us. But this boss has been defeated. That means that is destroyed. That means we get to have this power boon now, and that is absolutely fantastic and brilliant. Let me have that. 
Power Moon right there. Now we can continue into Bowser's Castle. I wonder how hard the final boss of this kingdom is going to be. Okay, so it's nice that we are healed. Now we can just run up ahead, have that checkpoint, make our way up here, of course. I can't see where we're going. I'm just going to avoid you guys. Let me up. Let me up. I'm probably dying now, aren't I? Yeah, I'm gonna die. Oh man, I had so many chances to make it back up. So sad, let's just go die now. So sad, so sad. How far do you have to go to die? Well, now we can do this again, but this time without dying, hopefully. Okay, come here. Come here. Now this time, just go here. Whoa, almost ran off and did the almost exact same thing again. Wait, do I need you for anything? Oh, I think I know what I need you for. Okay, let's go like this. You come here. Come! Come here. Come. Come, you must crush this one. Come! 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 Come here, Mario! We got to crush it so that we can get the power of Moon! Okay, there we go. We got that. And I'm not planning on dying anymore, so I'm not gonna get that checkpoint to the left. Not that I was planning on dying earlier. And there is still a chance that we are going to die here. Oh, get out of my way! Okay, okay, this is fine, this is fine. We are now a little birdie. Oh, this actually reminds me so much of uh, Super Kiwi 64, but I guess this game uh, came out before that game did. Because you have some similar movesets here. And you know what? Wait, wait. Oh, that was so strange. I was holding up, but we weren't going up. I'm not sure what was happening there. What the? What's going on? Okay, that was really weird. My game crashed here for some reason, but now we can continue on up this way. Grab it! Grab it! Okay, let me up here. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, now we should be at the top. We're about to be facing off here against the final boss in this kingdom soon. Okay, I just gotta make sure to not accidentally run off of the actual level itself. Oh, and that's right. I keep forgetting that it is Dr. Eggman instead of Bowser. Wow, look how far we ran up there. All right, who have we got here now instead of Bowser holding Princess Peach? We have Dr. Eggman holding Peach there. Yeah, and Peach is calling out for our help. And here's Sonic. Sonic just has that little smirk on his face. Can Sonic stop Dr. Eggman right now? You know what? Bowser's ship is actually kind of fitting for Dr. Eggman because he's been on all kinds of large mechanical devices and robots, hasn't he? Oh, and they're having a wedding ceremony on the moon. I've said this before, but guys, who do you think is going to be the first person to get married on the moon? Because at some point, there's definitely going to be somebody that gets married on the moon. And there's probably going to be a Wikipedia page about that. Oh, and down Sonic goes. Looks like we couldn't stop Bowser this time. Off he goes. But there's a different boss that we are facing off against. We're facing off against! This is called the Mecha Brutal, right? Oh my goodness. You know what? This seems like the kind of boss that you would face off against in a Sonic game also. Sonic faces off against so many big robot bosses, doesn't he? All right, so let's take these guys on. You know, I'm not expecting this to be- Ah, man. Okay, what I was going to say is I'm not expecting this- WHAT HURT ME THERE EVEN?! WHAT EVEN HURT ME?! Oh wait, I think you actually have to use the Pokeo to return these bombs. Not the, uh, you know what. Not the... Cappy. I don't think you could actually use Cappy. Okay, let's go like this. Hit this part. Now, let's make our way over here and we should just be able to climb up this. You know, maybe we don't even need the Pokeo to do this. But, let me up. Let me up, please. Okay. Oh, let me up, please. I'm gonna ground pound on this. Thank you very much. I'd like to stand on here, please. Uh-oh, can I come back, please? Where is it? No! Send me back! Oh, no, I didn't make it back. That is so sad, so sad. Okay, well, maybe we can, uh, get something from here. Let's hit this. Maybe we'll get a heart. Give me a heart. Hooray, we got a heart. And let's capture this guy over here. And now, let's just get ready to send these bombs back at you. Spit out a bomb! Spit out a bomb, you bomb spitter. There we go. Now give me the next one. Let's go like that. And go. No! Wait. It worked. It worked. I didn't think that it would work, but it looked like it did work. Okay, that's fantastic. Okay, now let's just get on up. Get on up. All right, let me out of here. Grab down there. And let me back onto this. There we go. Great place to stand. Now let me back on. Oh, no. No! made it back on that is so sad so sad really so sad very very sad so sad and we can't jump high enough to make it onto that thing that is so so sad so sad come here are you gonna run here 
I can run here because I can run much faster. I can get out of the way very easily, you know? Look at how fast I am. I can run circles around here, and those exploding things won't even get me because I am so quick. That is how quick I am. I am so quick that the exploding things will not reach me. Are you gonna give me one of those little cheap, cheap things? I guess they're not cheap, cheaps. What are these called? Pokios, that's what they're called. Let's see. Spit out some more of those. Oh no, now you're spitting out the firecrackers. Oh no, that is so sad. So sad. Very, very sad. So sad. And we're so much slower when we are in this thing compared to when we are just Sonic. Yes, give me that. And go. Yes! Yes! Fall over now. Okay, you didn't completely fall over. Okay, go. Shake the controller. Go! Shake the controller. Okay, now hold on. After this, there is one more, I think. Let's see. Plan here. Now just wait. 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 Okay, let's go. And let me on! Yes! We made it on! We made it on! We made it on! Where's the final one? Okay, hopefully. Ah! I was gonna say, hopefully we don't mess this up, but we did. Oh, that is so sad. So, so very, very sad. So sad. Can we capture a Pokio? Any Pokios to catch? There's a Pokio right there. Come to me. Come to me. Can I send any more bombs back at you? No, because you're spitting up firecrackers. Now that is so sad. So sad. Such a long boss fight. That is really so, so sad. So sad. So very, very sad. So sad. Everyone, please comment so sad, because that is so sad. Go. And... Go! Yes! Yes! Okay, at least that worked. Whoa, that was weird how it kind of got pushed out of the way a little bit, because it was close to the barrier, I guess. Let me up here. Let me up here. Now let me just grab out on this final guy. Let me just get him. Let me just get him. Let me just take him out. There we go. Now you're defeated, right? There we go. Finally, it explodes and we have defeated this boss. Okay, are you gonna explode? There we go. Now you are exploding. That is nice. Brutal's blasting off again! Like Team Rocket blasting off again from Pokemon. And we've got some cool fireworks. And, more importantly, we get the Power Moon now. I really hope that my game doesn't crash so that I have to do this boss fight all over again. That would be rather unfortunate, wouldn't it? But now, it's time for us to go to the Moon Kingdom, because now the Odyssey will be fully restored. We will have that big, what would you even call that? Like the hot air balloon portion of the Odyssey? That will now be complete and we'll now be able to head there. Off to the Moon Kingdom we go. Okay, so we are now, on the moon with Sonic, and we're aware, are we going to- wait a minute. Is the speed value for Sonic different on the moon? It, it must goes. be, because over here it definitely doesn't seem like we are running as quickly. In fact, it seems like we are running here goes. much more slowly than usual. We do have the moon gravity since we here are on goes. the moon. But, here goes. yeah, it doesn't seem like we are going much faster, if any faster, than usual right now, huh? So maybe if I update this again, I will have to change that. Okay, but for now, grab this right here. Let's run to here, jump across, make it to here, and you know what? Why not grab this checkpoint flag right here, and let's go here to the goes. Sphinx. We are going to do the Sphinx shortcut. Because last time, here goes. this took me a few attempts. Sometimes you can get it very quickly, sometimes it takes a few attempts, but let's see. How we can do it. Okay, so you want to jump up to here. Whoop, whoop. Okay, get to here. Now let's see if, if we can do this. How does this work again? I think you want to face this way. Like this. Go. Throw Cappy. Oh no, I didn't get it. I didn't get it. Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Okay, so you go like this. Jump. Cappy. Nope, didn't bounce off of Cappy. Let's try this again. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We, let's line up. Let's line up. We got to do this. We got to do this. This is still first try. Let's go. 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 And bounce. Let me up there. Give me this wall. Why aren't you jumping off of that wall, Sonic? Go, go, go! Yes! And there we go! We made it up! Okay, that actually didn't take too long. That only took about a minute or two. So that's actually fantastic that we were able to get that. Okay, and now we are invisible Sonic for a moment. Let's just come over here. Let's just ground pound. Oh, let's just ground pound here. And there we go. Now we are no longer invisible, Sonic. Let's just roll along quickly on this red path over here and get in here and we will now have our regular speed back. By our regular speed, I mean we should have our super fast speed here. Yeah, yeah. Here's Sonic running in quickly. Sonic bursts through the door. Oh, and it almost looked like Cappy flew by also because we were throwing Cappy. But look, it's Dr. Eggman who wants to marry Princess Peach here. All right, let's run on up here. Hello there, Dr. Eggman. What are you doing with that giant ring there? You want to marry Princess Peach? 
Princess Peach wants to marry Mario, actually. Look at that hand reaching behind her there. Funny that his hand isn't connected to his arm. And here's Sonic. Dr. Eggman has such an evil laugh when he laughs like Bowser. Oh, stomps his foot. And down we fall. Sonic doesn't know how to fly, unfortunately. Happy may try to lift us, but Cappy isn't strong enough and we fall. And Sonic's just smirking the whole time, too. I think this fight isn't going to be too bad, especially- whoops! Especially, since we are super fast like this, and we should be able to get over to Dr. Eggman very quickly like this, okay, but he might be doing some of his tail attacks like that, but we can just keep hitting him like that. Okay, there we go. One nice hit out of three, so he should be defeated soon. Where are you going next, my Bowser friend? What if I just run? Are you going to do fire over there? What if I just run? Can't reach me with your fire attack. I'll just run over here. Aha! Whoa, you're actually going pretty fast. Okay, instead of jumping over the fire, I'm just running away from the fire. That is quite the funny way to avoid the fire attack. That's not something you see every day. Okay, now here comes some of the hats. Go. Well, I guess give me that Chepka. Yeah, there we go. All right, let's go, let's go. Where are you going, Dr. Eggman? In here? Let's go. Ah, I was hoping that we'd be able to get him right away, but that didn't work. But now he can come here before he even threw one of those spiky balls. Keep your spiky balls to yourself, Mr. Eggman, because we are going to punch you there. Okay, two nice hits on him. That's very nice. Almost defeated. We just need one more nice hit on him like that, and he's defeated. Okay, so let's see. Are oh, you going to use your fire attack? I thought you learned by now, Dr. Eggman, that your fire can't reach me. I am far too quick. I will simply run behind you and grab your tail. Oh, you won't let me grab your tail? You don't even have a tail, Dr. Eggman. How can I grab your tail? How can I defeat you if you don't have a tail to grab? Wait a minute, this isn't Super Mario 64. Okay, how many times are you going to use that fire attack? Are you going to keep doing it? Okay, I thought he was going to keep doing it until I jumped over it, but I think he did quite a few fire attacks there. Oh, now where are we going to go? Let's go here. Okay, then come here. Give me that one! No! So sad, so sad. Okay, at least we get to heal over here. Okay, let's do this again. Let's do this again. We can go quickly, so this shouldn't be too big of a deal. Go. Go! Look out! Yeah! Yes, that worked very nicely. Okay, come here. Go! Uh, I was hoping that we'd get him there, but that did not work out as intended. Yeah! There we go. Now we've got him. Okay, let's get ready. Jump. How many? Three, two, let's go. No, no! Oh, no, we got hurt, actually, but we're still getting him. One more jump, and there we go. Now he should be defeated. Goodbye, Dr. Eggman. What in the world? He splattered like a blot of ink. It's like he's a Splatoon character or something, and his head is knocked clean off. Yep. Yeah. Look at that! Dr. Eggman's head is just knocked clean off. It looks like we've defeated him. Let's head on over to Dr. Eggman. Oh! Hello there, Princess Peach. Uh-oh! Looks like everything is starting to collapse now and we are going to fall down also- Oh man, it's so funny to see Dr. Eggman without his head there. He looks quite dizzy. And looks like the floor is about to collapse, right? Yes. And... Let me save Peach, but down we all go! Hey, here we are. Hey, it looks like it is time to actually capture Bowser. What are we gonna do? Well, by Bowser, I mean Dr. Eggman. Let's capture him. <laughs> and there's no head. All right, we are now Dr. Eggman, and we have Princess Peach on our shoulder, which is kind of cool. Let's just slash our way through here. It's so weird to be slashing through this as Dr. Eggman. Well, and let's charge up a fire attack, actually, so that we can blast some fire breath at something if we have to, like this stuff up ahead. Look at that fire going through. Whoa, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Be careful, be careful, be careful, be careful, be careful, be careful. Let me up. Oh, we didn't make it up high enough. That is so sad, so sad, everybody. So sad. Very, very sad times over here. So sad. Okay, but now, attack this. Knock that over. And it's so cool that we also have a Mario hat here. Okay, so let's make our way here. We want to be careful to not fall because if we fall, we have to start this all over again. And look at what's going to happen when we go in the 2D section. We are... We're invisible. We are invisible! This is actually going to be so much more difficult than I expected! I don't know where I am! I have to press the fire breath button to find out where we are. Uh-oh. Where are we? I guess we're here. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Where am I? Okay, let's see where we are. Am I here now? I guess I'm here now. Where are we? I don't know where I am! Okay, go. Go! This is so difficult when you are invisible! This is the hardest that this section has ever been for me. 
Am I up here now? I've gotta go for it! Go, 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 go! I don't know where I am! Can I get up here now? Please? Where am I? Yes! Let me up, please! Yes, please! Let me out of there! I'm so lucky that I made it out there! I was so scared! I have never been that scared to do that section before. That is unbelievable that that actually worked. I'm so glad that that worked out the way that it did. Oh man, I am very, very lucky that that did work. And now let's just slash out this wall here and go to the final section so that we can hopefully finally beat the game. Okay, so now we just have to take out these four pillars. I think what someone in a comment said, if I understood correctly, is that they actually just stood in the center section and blasted fireball attacks at these. That is an interesting way to do this, guys. Let me know in a comment if you've ever done that before. Because over here, you want to be careful to not fall down here. It would actually be quite unfortunate if you did fall over here because then you have to restart this section from the very beginning but nice to go like this wait I don't want to fall there okay good 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 because you can't fall there so we don't want to fall there okay, so let's just break this one after this just one more to go oh don't fall don't fall don't fall don't fall don't fall be very careful very very careful okay let's just break this one that'll be fine okay now we just got to make it to the center right Oh, gotta go fast, gotta go fast, gotta go fast, gotta go fast. I know that's what Sonic says, and we're Dr. Eggman. Who's, I guess, the rival of Sonic. All right, attack the cube! Attack the cube! Destroy the GameCube over here! The GameCube did not have enough sales! Okay, my game actually crashed right as this cube was about to be destroyed. So I had to redo the entire Bowser fight and everything. Oh boy, and that was a lot of work. Okay, so let's get out of here and let's finally see what this game ending is like. So off we go over here, Bowser and Princess Peach, and Mario's also going to pop out. But well, instead of Bowser and Mario, it's actually Dr. Eggman and Sonic. And who's gonna pop out from here? Looks like Bowser and Peach, but out comes Sonic! Dr. Eggman goes there! His head is gone! Dr. Eggman's head is gone, but here's Sonic and there's Princess Peach. What a lovely ending we have to the game over here. It's so funny that these two are just coming together like this and Dr. Eggman's head is just knocked clean off in the background. I think that should be how the game ends. These two are celebrating here. It's just we're celebrating over there with Dr. Eggman's head is just completely clean knocked off. What's going on? Peach looks concerned. She thinks, wait a minute. If that's Dr. Eggman's body, then how come he's still moving? His head is back. Dr. Eggman's still okay. Yeah, and he's got piranha plant flower. Sonic thinks, oh no, I can do something better than that. I've got a rocket flower. Look at Sonic and Dr. Eggman fighting for Peach's affection. That is not something you may have expected to ever see before. But Peach thinks, no, the one that I want is Mario. Look at, look at how they turn slowly like that. Peach says, all right, let's go back to Earth. I've had enough of being on the moon. I don't want to be the first person to get married on the moon. And then there's Sonic and Dr. Eggman consoling each other. But, he says, alright, come on, let's go, it's time to go back to Earth. And I think, for some reason, Sonic's gonna be able to make it back to Earth, but not Dr. Eggman. Let's see what's gonna happen. Peach is flying off, they're running, wait, wait, Sonic, you can normally run much faster, what's going on? Oh, maybe he wants to give Dr. Eggman a chance, look at him jump up, bounce off Dr. Eggman, leave him on the moon, and the game's complete. I really recommend you watch my video where we play Sonic's Fury, it is Bowser's Fury, but you are Sonic, you'll love it if you enjoyed this video, thank you so much for watching, I hope you have an amazing day ahead of you, and take care, everybody.